What we have here is a project bike slash rolling chassis. It started life as one of the first 700 Sandcast CB750s off the assembly line. Probably built on the second day of production. As you can see, it's number CB750-1000 663. Um, it's missing some parts and some of the parts are damaged but what is left seems to be all original. Um, they've painted the headlight bucket and the fork ears but they were also the original blue. Um, this irritates me but it had the correct fender that wasn't damaged and uh, at some point somebody bobbed it uh, and uh, to this day I love the fact that people are bobbing and chopping motorcycles because this is a perfect example why you might regret it later um, if you're familiar with these sand casts you're familiar with this key switch um, gas tanks I don't know if they had a tank bag on here or what but there's some residue on both sides I haven't tried to take it off it's just like adhesive but the tank is dent free um, the inside of the tank I hope you can appreciate this it just gleams and uh, people with, familiar with these bikes know what's special about this tank um, seats in lousy shape in my opinion There's no oil tank on the bike right now. Uh, no gauges, so true miles unknown. And uh, this would be a good bike if you could find a Sandcast engine. You could put yourself together one of the earliest Sandcasts that I've ever run across. Um, that's it. Email me at Joe Veal, that's J O E V E A L, at AOL.com if you're interested or have an early Sandcast engine you'd like to sell me. Thank you.